right, see. Come here, buddy. Jaden's summer is winding down. That means back to school. For him, a new school, a virtual school at home. I'm pretty excited to start online school. I think it'll be cool. Jaden will begin Ohio Virtual Academy, a free public school online. Computers are provided to families loaded with the tools needed for classes. He'll interact with teachers over webcams and will have his hours tracked. He must pass Ohio proficiency tests. After deciding against online school last year, it was a difficult family decision to go virtual this year. We wondered, is this really the best choice? We didn't want it to be a decision that 10 years from now he said, you ruined my life by doing this. Although he has hobbies and is tech savvy, Jaden's parents have taken steps to avoid his loss of social interaction and extracurricular activities. We've made a, a point of him getting him into more activities and also ensuring that the friends that he does have at the school would continue to be his friends. Regular school kind of wasn't working anymore and it, it was time to try something different. If history class, which is something I really like, I can kind of, you know, learn a little bit ahead and, you know, go a chapter ahead to the Civil War when maybe, you know, in the other class I'd have to wait to go on. His parents admit there may be difficulties and this virtual classroom is not for everyone. This is new to us too, so we, we don't know how everything's going to be for sure. It, you know, it could have its pluses and minuses. Not all online schools provide the same quality. Choose wisely, says this Kent State researcher. You know, what kind of interaction does the teacher have? Some schools, they go online, that's all the teacher interacts with them. In other cases, a teacher will provide a phone call once a week, they'll talk with parents once a week, they'll email, they'll provide tweets. Another big change for Jaden at home? There are no snow days. But the good news is, is that if my internet's not working or something, I get the day off. That's education in the 21st century. On your side, Tom Livingston, News Channel 5.